This is the first in a series of short tutorials designed to help you get the most out of using Gravity Sketch in automotive projects. In this tutorial, we're going to be using reference planes to achieve more precise surfacing. So we're going to move this front fender surface to align it with the darker front mask of the car. One way to achieve this is to use plane geometry to align your surfaces. So start by creating a simple plane we can call it the reference plane using the central line option and position the plane manually. It's often useful to drop the plane's opacity so that you can see through to the surface you want to edit. Once the plane is in the correct position, we want to put the body surface into edit mode. It often helps here to switch sub D off so that you can see the basic surface topology more clearly. Select snap to other objects and using smart move, slide the control points to the reference plane you've just created. Each point will snap to the plane. Here, I'm repeating this process for the front mask of surfacing. And when you're happy with the position of control points, you can switch the surface mode back to sub D to see the final result. This method also works for features or details within a surface, like here with this surface detail on the body side. Uh, here I'm adding additional loops to the reference plane and putting it into sub D mode to get the curvature that I want to move the body surface to and repeat the process. Turn sub D off on the surface we're editing Make sure snap to other objects is selected and move the control points to intersect your reference plane. In this situation, smart move may or may not be suitable for the curvature that you're working with. and switching back into sub D mode, you will see the final result. We hope you enjoyed this short tutorial. Be sure to like and subscribe for more content.